um, I got a request to use the products from my Fab Fit Fun Box. So I washed up my makeup today and I'm going to start off with washing my face with the Dr. Brandt Clean Biotic pH Balanced Yogurt Cleanser with Chlorophyll. I'm still so confused by that chlorophyll thing. And <laughs> we're going to see how it goes. I'm also super concerned about my face. Um, my face and my skin hates me. As you know by now, if you've watched my previous videos, I have eczema and dry skin and I don't know who else, whatever else. My Maybe some rosacea. I mean, like, look at this. I definitely have rosacea in the past, so I probably still have it. <laughs> it just shows up whenever it wants. But I'm going to totally use this cleanser. I am going to be brave and I'm going to try it. I have tomorrow off, so that's a good time to try it. And I'm also going to use this Wander Baggage Claim Gold Eye Masks. Um, it's going to be the one that goes underneath here to help with whatever it is I have going on under there. Because as you can see, I got something going on. Dryness. I have... Wrinkles, fine lines. I am an aging woman, and this is just a fact of life. I mean, it's better than the alternative, right? I am alive. So I thought this was hilarious, by the way. I later realized when I was doing my video that I was like, baggage claim, gold eye masks. Baggage claim? I thought, is that really what the name of this stuff is? It totally is, which is really funny because... I work for an airline, like I've mentioned before, and you definitely feel like poo when you get off a plane and probably could use this massively amazing gold, it's like legit, gold eye masks. Um, Crazy, like 24 karat gold. I have like an eyelash going on right there. So I'm going to go ahead and start with my, washing my face. I did already... Um, take off my makeup with a makeup wipe, like I had said, and let's go ahead and get to it. moist because I just washed my face or if because it's moist from the package. I, oh, actually, I don't know if you can see, whoa, you saw that. <laughs> There's definitely a moistness in there. So they're keeping them nice and moist. Apply into a clean, dry under eye. Repeat on the other side, leave on 10, 15 minutes and discard after use. Uh, gently pat remaining serum into skin. Okay. So let's do it. Here goes nothing. So I will get back to you guys um, later and let you know how it goes. Bye. Hey guys, so it's been at least 15 minutes and so I'm gonna go ahead and take it off. Um, the whole point is to put moisture underneath the um, eye area, which is basically what it needs, is why it's probably dry and anything else that's happening with it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it off and see what's going on. And I'm gonna go ahead and pat in 
rub in, more so pat, because you don't want to actually rub this under eye area. It's a very gentle, fragile area that is a very thin layer of skin, which is what I learned over the years from having the issues with the under eye. That's what the dermatologist always told me. So you're just gonna pat in the excess um, moisture, and wow, I kinda, I think I can tell a difference. I don't know for sure, and you can probably tell better than I can tell, but I think that it might look better. Um, I definitely know that you're going to need more time than just a 15 minute eye mask and the whole point of why things come with more than one application is anything needs to be tried over time. So I can't say that I know that this is something that works or not and I can't recommend it necessarily, but I definitely enjoyed trying it and I really enjoyed getting that box for $25. I think that anybody could and should probably order that box for $25. That is a freaking great deal. But um, yeah, I'll let you guys know in the morning how it looks and see how it goes. I'm gonna go ahead and moisturize my face, go to bed, and I'll see you in the morning. Good morning, guys. Here I am in all of my morning glory. And I cannot believe I'm doing this. I used to never allow anyone to see me without makeup. And I guess as I'm getting older, I'm just not that concerned anymore. <laughs> but um, as you can see, I'm super dry. I slept horribly and I was sniffly, sneezing, allergic reaction to something, which always happens. I bet it was a coincidence. I don't necessarily think it was those eye patches, but... Um, it started right before I put them on. It just got worse throughout the night and yeah. So the bags are still there. Baggage claim bags. <laughs> and I mean, it's only one. You can never say anything about just one. So you gotta try more. But yeah, good morning. And there is my morning face. I'll update you guys soon. So it's been a couple minutes. I've had these gold mask is that what it's called eye mask on under eye mask anyways um what is it gold <laughs> baggage claim gold eye mask i've had them on for a few minutes there was a tingling sensation at first a little bit of burning but nothing serious i mean it still have a little bit of burning but i basically always have burning on my face i mean you can put freaking moisturizer on my face and it will burn so what's new it's totally normal it's actually not bad so i'm just still praying that it doesn't go crazy and puff up and be a mess tomorrow but here it is looks pretty cool looks so fancy and i really like it <laughs> i just hope it really helps soothe it i guess i should have taken a before picture but i'm basically trying to do a skincare routine over here that's all i'm trying to do and use my products because why else would we get the box if we're not gonna use it? So, I will update you soon. Uh, it's only been five minutes. We have at least five, 10 left. Hi guys, welcome back. And I just wanted to update you guys on using these baggage claim eye masks. This is the second time I've used them. So I can't say still that I know 100% that I love them or not. This product that you were familiar with from my previous videos. And um, I said I would update you guys at the end of the video I had made a week or two ago. So I wanted to give you a real review. I can't say again that I know for sure they feel okay. I mean, I think it's always good to put some extra moisture under your eyes and they're doing that. So that's cool. I don't know that I'd recommend them still or not, but also wanted to update you on the Dr. Brandt facial cleanser and the nightly um, face mask I've been using that I got, this one I got from my uh, FabFitFun. And then this one, I thought they were the same, but they ended up being different. And that's what I had said in my FabFitFun box that I thought they were the same, but they were different. This one I had gotten in, I think, Ipsy, but I might have been BoxyCharm. Ooh, sorry guys, I don't completely remember, but I just know that they pair well together the Clean Biotic um, Dr. Brandt pH Balance Yogurt Cleanser with Chlorophyll. Okay, I can't stop, I'm sorry. It's just so weird, I don't get it. But um, I love this. It feels so like useless, to be honest. 
when you take it out and um, to get ready to use it, it just feels like nothing's really being done. Like it doesn't feel like it, it doesn't set up. It doesn't feel like it's cleansing, but I know a lot of times not setting is a good thing. Maybe it doesn't have parabens or something or sulfate. I don't know because this really doesn't have a lot of description on it, but um, I do know that it feels like it's doing nothing. However, my face has never felt so good in my life and I don't know for sure if it's this or if it's the nightly recovery sleeping mask that I've been using with it or if it's both. I mean, it's highly possible it's the combination. All I know is my face has felt so soft and I was having a lot of breakouts down here for a little while, which I told you I don't really get acne. Thank you, Jesus. But I was and um, haven't had that. I mean, we are getting into like it was a weather change. Maybe I was getting the acne from that. And who knows? I do have a little bit of acne right there at the moment. But otherwise, my face, besides, you know, blemishes and stuff, it looks really good, if I do say so myself. So I'm super happy with these two products. And in fact, I'm a little nervous because now I think I'm going to have to replace them and buy them. I'm going to go ahead and um, update you on how much they cost. But so far, so great. And I just can't say enough about these little subscription boxes because they just really let you try some really nice products and figure out if you like them or not. So, like I said, I was going to update you, so here I am, and I'll go ahead and take these off now because I've had them on for a little while, so why not? Um, it doesn't feel as, maybe I'm really dry under there right now because I was doing so well with my under eyes for the last, like, week or 10 days, but now they feel pretty dry and they felt irritated today, <laughs> that whole situation I have going on. So probably a hard time to tell again if this stuff works because of my never ending issues. But I mean, it feels a lot more moisturized than did before. These kind of dried up quickly this time where the last ones didn't, but I was cooking. So maybe the steam, I have no idea. It's hard to review these things sometimes because of the things that you're doing with them. I mean, my face has been in good shape in maybe I've been because I've been cleaning my brushes more. I mean, there's just so many combinations of reasons why, but I definitely can tell you, I do like these two little products and I'm happy to have had them. So I will continue getting my subscriptions. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will be doing more. If you want more like that, for me to use the products that I've been getting from my boxes and let you know with a real review of how I feel versus maybe just first impressions first impressions. What's your first impression about me? <laughs> Comment below. So again, thank you for coming and I appreciate you being here. Bye.